Hello everybody, this is Dark Gaming, and welcome to a game called World of Final Fantasy. I saw this come out today on Steam, thought I'd buy it, you know, see what World it's about. World of Final Fantasy! It's kind of weird with the setup, because it's like so empty, almost. Prologue. Whoa. Awake but anyway, last. I'm excited to uh, see what this has to offer. This is weird. <laughs> it looks good. I mean, I am replaying in 4K, but... It actually looks really good. I understand that it's still 30 FPS, but with the speed of the actual game, I don't think it really needs... 60 FPS to be honest. I get, of course it would be nice, but I mean This looks good. Sister. Wait, who's that then? Did I miss the name of the other guy? Might have missed the name of the other guy. Expecting words at some point. <laughs> okay. It's just giving me like major Kingdom Hearts vibes. This reminds me so much of the Kingdom Hearts. What is going on? Like I said, the graphics are pretty impressive. Even, like, the cartoony style is just done so well. Just from the- or at least in this scene. But, I want to see what the rest of the world is like first. Time to wake up. Um, they just fell off a tower. <laughs> oh, waking up again. his head. And I hope the entire game is like those cutscenes. That looks so good. Oh, am I gonna make it? Whoa. The boss hates when I'm late. Eh, it still looks pretty good. It's always gonna look, I don't know. The yeah, sure I'm impressed with how it looks so far. It seems like small maps though. Which I'm not sure about. But of course this is just still the first area, so. Hey, I'm here. Huh? How'd she get in if no one's here yet? Good morning. I'm real sorry. I hope you haven't been waiting long. Huh? The customer. Right. She needs some water. Oh, no thanks. A pint. I mean, a cup of coffee, please. Oh, and bring the whole jar of sugar. I'm gonna need it. Right. That's one cup of joe. And I'll get you one of the big jars. Has nobody made the coffee yet? Come on. Get together, guys. I'm sorry, miss. This might take a while. Hey, no hurry. Time's not an issue. Hmm. 
Like, I love Here you go. the Final Fantasy, like, telling the story. I'm more interested in this than I have you. been in, like, a ton of games, of recent games, because it's just... Characters just have so much personality in Final Fantasy. <laughs> That's a lot of sugar. I think the phone's gonna ring. The phone has to ring. I'm like 99% sure the phone's gonna ring. There you are! Mon! Keep it down, Rain. How about acting your age, huh? Hey, don't come <laughs> down to me. Listen, last time I checked, little bro, I've been around a few minutes longer than you. <sighs> Twins? Okay, okay. I get it already. Very sorry. Ah, uh, his name's Lan. Okay. <laughs> so, what's up? I'm all ears. Well, you don't have to get all sarcastic. Uh, you really are all ears. Uh, what? <laughs> Has he really not noticed? So long. Have you seen anybody this morning? Well, yeah. I mean, I'm looking right at you, aren't I? And there's that customer. What? You didn't even see her? Dude. Uh, yeah, but... Uh, look! Come with me right uh, now! Easy! Yeah, let's get so far. There's nobody here! So, it's a quiet morning. Maybe they just... I mean no one! Huh? Lon, That's a good point. have you bumped into anyone today besides her? Uh, now that you mention it, I guess not. And this isn't setting off any alarms? Well, should it? You yeah. two really don't remember a thing. Huh? What was that? Who are you? If you're from around town, then I don't know you. Uh, Rain Manners. You two really don't remember a thing. Would you please just answer my question? You can call me Anna Crow. Anna Crow will work. That is really how you spell Crow? That's K-R-O-S. Like, cross. <laughs> okay, well, we woke up to a ghost this Anna. morning. Maybe you know why? Yes, you're quite alone. Or Anna? But you always have no, to- No, I'm pretty sure it's Anna. Huh? This world, it's always been the two of you. A world without time. One that ended when it began. What? That's the weirdest thing I've heard. But don't worry. Just because the world ended, doesn't mean that it's going anywhere. You know, I have been checking up on you two. Until now, you were nothing but blank stares. So imagine my surprise when Lon took my order. What a morning. Okay. Now you're kind of scaring me. So, now that you're awake, we've got a story to tell. Cool. Which brings us to... Tama! Right to here! Uh, who the hog put this thing on my head? Yeah, I did try to mention it before. Really? You still didn't me. notice? I'll go on ahead and link up a path. You the gun! Huh? Hey, hey! You hey, can't just uh, leave! Huh. Salutations! The name is Tama, and I'm here to help out. Does anyone have any questions? Hmm. Wait, I've got tons of questions. Why were you sitting on my head? And how the hell can a fox even talk? That's the seriously the first thing on your mind? <sighs> now I just see why Inna Crow is just about the ready to throw in the towel. We're not allowed to be confused! Uh, hey, whoa, whoa, take it easy there, Lon. I thought you were upset too! Let's start the over. I'll make us some of the coffee. Huh? Oh, yes please. But I already made some coffee before you got here. How can you just roll with this, Rain? Chill the owl! 
You'll live them much longer. Yeah, Lon. You shouldn't start out your morning with so much stress. Oh, would you the like some sugar? Three cubes for you, right, Lon? Huh? I'm good uh, with just one. No. Okay, I... I'll have to go and put the coffee on. But I just said I... You know what? Just give me my dang cup of coffee. <laughs> good start. It's a little long, though. Mirage Keepers? Me and Rain? Definitely That's a little long. Those the marks on your arms are proof. You were born to work the miracles. Miracles? Our arms can do that? Dude. How could you the forget? You used to command a whole legion of them. You were masters of them. Powerful living illusions known as mirages. In the fact, even the Pleiad answered to you and those are the seven strongest mirages of all. With their power, you could have the ruled over all the world. Oh. So, we could have ruled the world because, what, we controlled these mirages? Well, that's what I've heard. From who? What do you mean? In a crow that told me, of course. But I'm not the reminiscing. I've got to teach you two to use mirages again. Yeah, this is super huh? long. How's that? First off, I'm going to present you with my very own prismarium. It's cool, so but... what does it do? Wow. With this prismarium, the mirage inside becomes yours, and you can then make it do the anything and the everything you command. So let's the try it right now in glorious combat. Wait. What? What? Huh? Okay, here we go. Here we go. Cool. I changed my mind. Go this is this is definitely Pokemon. This is definitely you Pokemon. You gain a little bit of AP each the time your turn comes around in battle. The amount of AP you need depends on the what you're trying to do. So make the sure you use them wisely. Okay. Take turns. Makes sense. All right. Abilities are mapped to those buttons. Awesome. Yep. Okay. Alright. Oh, it looks like it's ATB as well. So let's go to attack. Uh, attack. Oh, I also can attack and defend. That's interesting. Okay. So, so my two main characters eventually will have attacks. And then as well as my Pokemon, or Mirages as they're called. And that is definitely looks like Pikachu. <laughs> Okay. Okay, I get it. It's gonna be fun. Wait, what is classic? Ooh. I don't have any abilities. So I'll just attack. Okay, they should have gave me at least one ability here. Um, not having any abilities makes it literally like I'm just waiting for my turn. A little slow. Yeah, definitely too slow here. I then knew that you had talent. So did I win? Active, semi-active, and wait. An active time. Um. Okay. I'll beat open the quick. Yeah. Awesome. Okay. All right, all right. I think I've seen enough for one to tussle. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I would have definitely appreciated a skill though. That would have been very much appreciated. Um, because honestly, I was just clicking one one button the whole time. We're on the surpassed. No, the Mirage could stand up to you. Dude, seriously? Dude, the seriously. It's <sighs> hard to believe. I'm sure it is. As far as I can tell, you two have lost everything. All the memories and experience you've ever accumulated. Oh, but wait. 
Of course that would have happened when you in this world were spliced out. Huh? So not only did they lose the mirages they had, they've been the stripped of all their memories of the mirages too? But I guess that explains why all their other memories seem to be largely on the affected. What? Listen, let me show you something. Hmm. Okay. Whoa. This area is nice. There, just beyond this light, lies another world called Grimoire. That is where you'll find all the mirages you've lost. You mean they're all inside this gate? You got it. Are you ready to conquer them again? Yes. So, um, if we do manage to find all the lost mirages, does that mean we'll be able to remember the things we forgot? Well, I don't know about that. After all, you lost your memories. It's not the same thing as forgetting them. Oh. But, even if you don't remember Grimoire, Grimoire still knows a lot about you. You're certain huh. to find traces and records of your past. Okay. So, like... It's a good setup. You're saying, whether we remember anything about ourselves or not, we can still find clues about our past and the things we've done? Correct. And if you keep on gathering mirages, I think you might even have your family in due time. Uh, our family? Huh? Well, I guess it does make sense that we'd have parents. Oh, yes. So then, you going? You going? Will you journey to Grimoire? <laughs> <laughs> I hope Anna joins our party. Wow, they just left their world behind with, like... Yeah, I want to say. But they left their world behind with literally zero, like, reservations. They left super quick. Chapter 1. Land of the Lilikin. They didn't need to get anything from home or anything. They just left. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. Wellspring Woods. So, this must be Grimoire. What the heck? What? <laughs> what? You look like such a little dweeb. <laughs> <laughs> I know. We look ridiculous. Yeah, you do. <laughs> oh, don't worry. I'm sure that's how everybody in this world must look. Anna Crow just wanted to make sure you had a nice and a handy way of blending in. Wow, she can do stuff like that? That is awesomely weird. Well, this kind of works out. We won't have anybody gawking at our arms. Way to find the silver lining. Uh, yeah. I'm definitely changing them back. Chip job. Okay. I think it was... I guess we should head straight down this path? Yeah, definitely it's going back to the uh, full size. Manage... Oh. oh, hello. I spy another mirage. That is the call the Choco Chip. What do you It's a Chocobo. For? Go on and imprison the it. Okay. Chocobo. That's funny that my first Pokemon is Chocobo. Oh wait, no, I still get to keep you. Cool. Does that mean she's gonna be on my team now too? <laughs> because she's fighting with me. Oh, this time he's with me. So what now? First, you're the going She's got a sword. Face. It looks sort of like a prismarium. What is it? That's the called a prism. Use it to the make the Choco Chicks prismarium. Every time you find a new the mirage you haven't seen before, it'll be recorded in Anna Crow's special mirage manual. Whoa. Otherwise known as a Does it even Pokedex. You the betcha. And then whenever you <coughs> Pokedex. add a new mirage to the manual, <laughs> you receive one of its prisms. But only the first time the mind you. Okay, first, try the weakening the Choco Chip, then they use your prism. Got it. Okay. Let's do this. You can switch between mirages with... I don't know. Oh, gosh. That's way too much to remember right now. Nope. Just gonna ignore it. Libraria. Libra. Libra? Libra. 148 HP. Runs 132... Wait, what? Big stack. That's cool. 
Oh, it takes both into account. Okay. That's sweet. Do you have any skills? No, you don't. Okay, that did 45. So there, I'm guessing... A prism tunity. Use the imprism command to declaim that mirage for your own. Interesting. For one, the select the imprism command. Okay. You might have to try different things before certain mirages will let down their guard and give you a chance to imprison them. Think the outside of the box. Cool. Okay. I'm telling you, it's exactly like Pokemon with an ATV battle system. Though. Okay, um... B. Cool. Hey! There we go! You did it! Now that the Choco Chick is inside the Prismarium, it's yours to the keep! We did it! All right! I want him to get a sword. Oh, you still get the experience. That's good. They're all level 2 now, too. Okay. I really need him to get a sword, because that's cool. Let's look at the abilities. Whoa. That's quite a few abilities. Alright. Um. Yeah. Let's just leave default. Uh, let's go. Choku chick. Okay. Cool. I can see the choco chick running around in the prismarium. Pretty the neat, huh? Next, why the don't you have a go at stacking that choco chick on your head? Here, watch, I'll just show you. Oh, now I get it. So when I saw you perched on Lon's head back in Ninewood Hills, that's what you call stacking. Yep. That's the right. While I'm up to here, I get to take it nice and the easy. Uh, is that stacking or slacking? <laughs> when you create a stack, the HP of everyone in the stack gets the added together. Like they say, strength in the numbers. Oh, so it's like combining into a super robot. Better than yet, your magic and other abilities have the potential to change too. It all depends on how your stack is the configured. Huh? Oh, I don't need any action figures when I get to blast out super attacks like a super robot. Well, just be the careful. Stacking doesn't make you invincible. Some of the enemy attacks have the power to unstack you. In other words, bye-bye super robot, so to speak. Yowzers. It does sound like bad news. It's true that we are individually the weaker when we're unstacked. But look on the bright side. Since we each get our own the turn in battle, we can use the extra moves to have one member attack and another the heal. It can be very the helpful. Huh. Depending on the situation, you might even decide to unstack yourselves by choice. Right. Think carefully and choose the best setup for the job. Okay. How much can I stack? Okay. Stack setup. Okay. So you have one large, one medium, and one small. The twins are M. Okay. So they're only large oh, when they're in this. Hold on. And the switch between giant size and lilikin size. So they're Depending only on large. Size, you can make different stacks. You won't be allowed to put big things. So these on are medium. The small when the large, stack. medium. So to get on top large. of a mirage, you need to be in lilikin form. Okay. Wait, but I need the best to. Way to learn is to... And that's not what I want to do either. Here we go. Stack setup. Okay. So right now we're in this. Let's go ahead and put the choco or the choco chick. Choco chick on top of that. And there we go. So now when I go into combat. The best way to learn is to try it once you've rounded up a few more mirages. You'll pick it the up in no time. And then we huh? should be able to move on here. But there's nowhere else to go. What are we gonna do? Never the fear! Look the closely! This may appear to the be a wall, but it's actually a guinea golem. Is this a mirage too? Yes. Not in the traditional oh. the sense of the word. But you'll see these pests all over Grimoire. And unless you they give them what they want, they'll give you a hard the time and block the way. So what is it they want? It really 
it depends on the gimme golem. So the first thing you'll have to do is examine it. Okay. That makes sense. Alright. Gimme, gimme! A luster. So where do we find that? That choco chick you just imprisoned ought to be able to track the down what we need. But first things the first, you're going to have to unlock the right ability on the choco chicks, the Mirage Board. Mirage Board? Oh gosh. Okay. Um. Right. Okay. So. Mirage Board. Choco chick. Um. Stroll. How much more stats does it get? Here? Where's my SP at? Oh, okay. That's up there. So I have two. I could get RAM too. Awesome. Wait, so does that mean that... I can also upgrade yours then. Right? You have four SP. Uh, sure. We'll give you more strength. That makes sense. Okay. So why can't I up yours? Let's go to items. See what we get here. We have a prism. We have a bunch of keys and stuff. Abilities. So, these guys don't have any abilities, though. The only ones that do are the extra people. Huh. Hey, the Choco Chicks... Oh, he's out for a stroll. Okay. So we do what we were supposed huh? to. He found something. Hey, let's release. That was Yay! really easy. You have found it. Now try examining the gimme golem one more at a time. Huh? He found something. You know what, guys? Um, I actually think I'm gonna end this one here. Uh, we will continue with this next time. Whatever's after the gimme golem. Uh, I'm think. Yeah, I think we've gone off long enough, so uh, we'll continue right here next time. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.